My allies are going to move forward. Excellent. 48% right now. Now, can you take that? No, you cannot. 600 men are defending. Excellent. Okay, yeah, this has got a lot of men defending. We have been declared war on. God, God damn you. Yenseppi. So one of the Khazaria have declared war on me. There's one piece of land. Are you kidding me? What a ridiculous war. How many men does he have? 8,000. Are you kidding me? He has 8,000 men. Oh my. Okay, wow. Okay, this guy could actually... This guy could cause a lot of trouble, actually. Um, I'm actually worried. Huh. We might have to turn back. Because me and my allies can defeat them. Then again, I can't leave Persia. The moon has been growing full during the past couple of nights. And with your restlessness growing, you can sense it coming. It is time again. Time to embrace the moon madness. Oh, you run through the night. Seek and pray. You eventually find it and you pounce. Blood. Killed a dog. Ah, oh, it's a, a poor baby dog. The morning after. We gained, we gained Marshall still again. He has inherited the land. Okay. Well, let's call upon them. We're at 48%. Yeah, taking this is so much more important than that one piece of land. Yeah, you know what? To be honest, yeah, it's far more important. I want to take this. We could even just settle. We could just settle. Have our Zoroastrian Empire. Okay, just a little bit longer. They still can't take this back, so we're fine here. These guys are taking this. So yeah, we should get a lot of points from that once that's gone through. Time's at four times speed. I can't see any of his men at all. Don't know where his main army is. I guess they're maybe in the Abbasid lands. That's the only thing I can think of. Possibly. 4,000 Abbasid men coming up here. 52%. Okay. We need someone to educate Oog again. He's a good educator. Okay, Savenk. How about you do that? Perfect. Okay, so they've now gone to those lands. Okay, we need to try and stop them. Uh, this revolt is basically done. How about white peace? Yeah, just white peace. Just go away, please. Just that's all I care about. Just want to get rid of some of the wars so we can have more men to concentrate on the other wars. The more important ones. Now, he's not really causing too much damage right now. 300 Zoroastrians up here. And uh, we've got 3,000 men over here, not really doing much. Okay, so our main army is just around here. We do have enough men actually to defeat him. Uh, it shouldn't be too bad actually. Just need to make sure the allies actually follow me. And we'll be fine. Dangerous faction, 76%. Okay, that's fine. There we go, 67%. Well, let's go and attack these guys just so they can't take this for now. Okay, so they're running away. Uh, Sky, your favorite war horse, has taken his last gallop. <gasps> oh my god. We need another horse. Get a horse. We'll call him Dragon. We have Dragon. We deserve Dragon. We've been doing well so far. It is time for you to recognize the full independence of them. I will not be blackmailed. So we've now got an independence war happening as well. So a, a lot of things are happening right now. You pull the sword as the dead corpse of the last foeman to fall by your hand in battle. Excellent, gain 100 prestige. Everyone loves me. Everyone loves us, 74%. Yeah, we need to get back. <laughs> we have to get back. We're facing a complete revolt right now. Jesus. But we should still be okay. We should be okay. My nephew. Okay, he seems fine. Ugaza. He didn't turn out as good as we hoped, but, you know, not everyone can, can they? They're going to go down here, so we'll wait for them to do that. 5th of May. And then we'll go destroy them. 
There we go. Perfect. Uh, we just want to do the center. Um, I guess him. <clears throat> Sorry about that. My uh, my throat's been a bit weird recently. I've been talking way too much, I think. Over clan limit. Really? We're over the clan limit? That's ridiculous. That's kind of ridiculous we go over the clan limit because they declared an independence war. That's kind of crazy. I right, 77%. Need to find an easy place to take. How about we just take this one then? To amass wealth. Perfect. We got a lot of gold at the moment. We can make peace with these guys. Wow. <laughs> he was captured straight away. Oh my god. Okay, well there we go. That's the end to the independence war. Well, that went pretty well. I must say. Now obviously we could just take all his lands off him. Give them to, to real people we can trust. I think we should. Yeah. We could revoke his titles. Adopt religion. Settle feud. He'd still not do it even though you're in my jail. I guess we're going to revoke your title. Um, This county and this county. Guess we could revoke the duchy. No. You'd not like us to take anything? Jesus. Even though you're the one who betrayed us? Okay, fine. You'll stay in jail forever then. We'll see. We'll, we'll, we'll deal with him after the war. There's a lot of things going on right now. At least that's one thing dealt with. So you're 9%. Okay. We're losing a lot of people right now. A lot of the rebels are going around killing people. And we need new commanders. Okay, Bork. You'll be one of our new commanders. Okay, that's it. Open council position, court chaplain. Let's go for Bork. Okay, again, you can be it. Khan Bork is our chaplain. Good job. Congratulations. You're going up in the world. I should probably go help those guys. That would have been a good idea. I was not paying attention. See, this is what happens when it goes too easy. You kind of don't pay attention. And up north, we're having problems. The 6,000 men, they seem to have taken quite a lot. So we need to go stop them, really. I do have the capital, so I mean, we don't really have to wait, to be honest. We can just go. You know what? I think we should go and attack them. 2,000 men up there, though. Then again, I want Persia. I do want Persia. 8,000 men down here. Jesus. 79%. Come on, come on. Get there in time. Okay, they didn't get there in time. But we can just go up here. Just try and just defeat men for now. Try and get as much war score as we can as quickly as possible. 81%. Capture some people. Uh, Drong's host. Apparently, there's, there's quite a, thing, a lot of things going on here in Persia right now. But uh, the wolf, he's doing a good job. Our heir is Kopti the Wise. Now, he's also Manichaean, so that's good. But he's a, he's a much better leader. I'm probably looking forward to him being our new leader. That'll probably be much better. Okay, we're going to just go straight back here, I think. God damn it. What are you guys getting into a battle for? Come on, get them in time. No, we're not going to get in time, but we can destroy them. There, teach them a lesson. 85%. Damn, we're so close. Okay, we can just, we can assault this, actually. With more than 10 times. 89%. Damn, we're so close. It's ridiculous how close we are to winning. 90%. Okay, I'm going to have to go back. I'm going to have to take some of that land back. Because otherwise we're... Oh, he's done it. 100%. Okay, looks like he's going to take that land. Just take it. Yep, okay, that's fine. You know what? I'm not too bothered. I did not hold that land. Um, it split up our, our horde, but it's not a terrible thing, to be honest. In the end, it's probably worth it. 
Gain in Persia, I think is worth it. Okay, he's got 1,000 men down here, apparently. 2,000 men. Now, they're in mountains. They're coming to attack me. No, they're not. They're escaping. Or going to Quorn. Now, which way is most of the men going? Most of them are going to Lower Stan. I could go attack him on the mountain, but I feel like that's just risky. Especially when we're at 89%. There's not much point to that. Might as well just go defeat some of their smaller armies. Try and just get the 100%. Let's go this way. We'll try and get to these guys down here. 25th of August. 25th. Okay, one of them will get to the 6th. Damn it. The different place. Damn. Let's try and get him in time then. 8th of September. Yeah, they'll escape. 90% at the moment. Okay, so they're going to go attack them. I'm going to let them do that. Because then we can just jump in and help. Okay. Uh, there we go. We'll just jump in to try and help. Hopefully we'll get there in time. If not, it doesn't matter. Okay, now we'll just go and attack. This will win us the war. There we go. Your experience of matters of war has increased. Organization. Direct leader. Direct leader. We're, we're a wolf. God damn it. We're a wolf. Okay, that gave me 2%. So that did not go as I planned. Go attack them. There we go. 93%. Some of that can fall easily. I think we can take this, actually. I think we can take this. Now, we're stuffing attrition right now. We do not have enough to take that yet. Might have enough to take this one. Especially with our allies there. Okay. We could assault. Yeah, we have enough to assault. Only just, though. Let's do it. There we go. 97%. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. 8,000 men. Muradid Sultana. We need to stay away from them. I need somewhere quickly we can take. Somewhere weak. Somewhere where they brought up all the men. Like this one. Nah, it's still quite strong, actually. Damn it, there's no other wee, really weak places apart from that one. But they're going to there, so we don't want to go there. Okay, we're going to stay away from there then. Go this way. No, nope, actually don't go that way, go this way. Just want to get my men out of the way of this big army. Okay, looks like that big army's disappeared. 98%. We're so close. 98%. Okay, that big army is coming terribly close. I'm just going to try and get away. Don't want to get into a fight with them. 94. Damn it. They take that land back. That's why. Oh, don't go that way. Don't go that way. So he's going to go to the capital, it looks like. Now they're going to Yazd. Let's go. As long as he doesn't take our capital. I do 5%. Now, if I can go here and take this, we may be okay. Don't take the capital back. Don't you dare. Okay, should be enough men to defend it. We can take this. 99%. We could take this one, actually, as well. And 98%. Damn it. So close. They are two. Oh, they just took it in time. Those sneaky, sneaky devils. Okay. This is bad now. So they're actually catching up with us now. Not much I can do about this. 400. There's 400 here. They'll probably just assault this. Take that back. Yep, there we go. That's going to take back all the capital. Now, if we can get them to move out the capital. If I can take a bit more land, then go back to the capital when they've left it, then hopefully we can take this back really quickly. And hopefully win that way. So if I just go over here quickly. We'll assault this. Okay, yeah, they're getting they're taking them all back. 89%. Yeah, if we can just go in and take them back. But he needs to take them all back. So once he takes that last one, hopefully he'll move out. Let's go try and help these guys. Uh, new steward. 
You can be the steward. New commander. Hmm. Well, I, I'm going to go for you guys because I don't like the other family as much. So we should not have them there. We really need to end this blood feud. We just settle feud. You'd still not do it. Fine. Fine. How dare you. Now, as long as I take that last one, we can just jump straight in. If we take a few of those, we've won. So the tide is turning against us, but this is not lost. We should just see what he does with his big army. That's really what matters here. Okay, he's going to come straight towards us, it looks like. So we need to get round. We need to outmaneuver him and get to there. Unless he's going to Quam. He's going to stay there, it looks like. I want to keep at least two provinces away, so that way he can't, like, surprise attack me. But all those provinces we've taken before, they're now quite low when it comes to manpower. So if we just jump here, we'd actually have more men than he does, and we could take it. Perfect. Let's just go straight there, then. We should be fine, then. He won't attack us in the mountains, I would think. Then again, it's the AI, you never know. We defeated uh, one of the other rebels now. Okay, take that. Quickly, go, go, go. 83%. Okay, they're now running off to Ray. Give us a chance now to take all this. Take it, take it. Okay, 86%. 92%. 97%. And 100%. I told you, didn't I? Enforce demands. There we go. That lovely blue. Ah, oh, the lovely blue. So it looks like their leader, he's now become a Khan of Persia. Ikta. He's still an Ikta, of course. So there we go. The Azurs have now taken Persia. What a lovely day for everyone. We can press the Ducal Claims. We can usurp a title, the Emirates. Seems kind of silly. Dangerous factions. Yeah, definitely. We're definitely going to have some problems now. So, yeah. Titles can be created. So, we do not have uh, the Empire of Persia. But, yeah. So, where does this put us then? We have 5,000 vassal troops. Intrigue. Now, condition is the Emperor of Persia. Control Duchy of Kiva, Duchy of Merv. Duchy of Tigris. Okay, there's a lot of duchies we do not control. There's a lot of things we do not have. So there's definitely something I have to do at some point. Okay, now we captured you as well. Now I think we should get rid of your... Uh, this. Yeah, we need to get rid of that title. Break it all apart. There we go. They're all broken apart, these Buddhists. That should hopefully keep them at bay. Now, I am a good guy, though. I am a just man. So, we, we've already now punished him. We should now be reasonable to him. Uh, this man was obviously one of his uh, vassals, so we'll let him go. That way, the vassals will like us. This guy, uh, we should obviously uh, banish. Mazdaki. Ma uh, Mubarak, sorry. Uh, he is one of the Shia. He's obviously a man we captured in battle, I guess. Hmm. Ransom, 14 gold. Mukta, again, something we were able to capture. I guess we can also... Yeah, just let him go. He's, he's no one. You can't get any money for him. Another one of his people. 70 gold, perfect. And the lovely... Just let that wife go. They're now our vassals, to be honest. So there we go. Now, the Kazaria has now kind of split up my realm. We have two. I would love to settle in Persia. Now, that's the question. The city of Conch. Okay, we have a lot of places. But, yeah. Now, I don't think I have any of this land. So, we can't settle here. Oops. Okay, so we can't settle there. So, this is a real big danger at the moment. This means we could be in trouble... Obviously. 
Yeah, because they'll probably rebel. So that's definitely not a good position. But we we took them. We won. <laughs> how long can we hold it is really the question. I'm not sure how long we can do that. We'll have to wait and see. Have to wait and see. Now obviously uh, he's in trouble. But he's still the Khan. I'd like to take that from him. His opinion of you. And we cannot take it anyway. We have no reason because we have a truce. Ah, didn't really, like the, didn't really like the subjugate one, but it was all we could do at the time. How are the factions? Can the factions, some of the smaller, uh, smaller Buddhists have kind of joined. That's fine. We could probably take two of these, but I don't think we need to, to be honest. Wrong type of hold in. Let's try and uh, let's burn these down. Pillage hold in. There we go. And here. I can't pillage. Oh, there we go. Pillage hold in. Do it. Perfect. So there we go. We pillage these places. And let's move our army up here. So perfect. Okay, that didn't go that didn't go too badly. It could have gone better. Overall, though, we could have lost a lot more, but I think it was okay. He'd be a better court chaplain. Okay, that's fine. Should we go up here and take out these guys for now? This guy should be there. Uh, Bork. There we go. Perfect. Now, what to do, what to do? What do we do now? <laughs> we have so many things we could attack. Who do we attack next? That is a big question, actually. Not sure who I want to attack. So we need a lot of land, obviously, to do what we wanted to do. I think we need some of the Abbasid land as well. But they're kind of having problems at the moment. I don't think we need to worry too much about them. I'd rather concentrate maybe these guys. We should probably go for these guys. Conquest. De jure, make tributary. Invasion. Yeah, we can't do invasion. Subordination. Subordinate them. Zirbais or Ashram rulers might join him. Yeah, we could probably do that. Hmm. One would take all the land, though. But we could take probably most of it. We could probably take this. Probably attack these guys. We could, yeah, we could probably take those. We'll probably attack those two, I guess. That is probably what I'll do next, actually. But for now, it's going to let our uh, armies rebuild a little bit. They're running away. Of course. And there we go. We'll leave our men there. Let them sort of recuperate for now. But I think that went well. Let's see what's going on in the rest of the world. Looks like Middle Frank here has inherited everything in uh, Europe. There's also Burgundy, though. Kingdom of Burgundy. Carlin. Navarre is doing okay. Pickland has grown a bit. Yeah, just looks quite general at the moment. Just a mess, really, though, in Europe, it looks like. Cilicia is growing quite big. Cazaria has grown massive as well. There's a lot of things to worry about. Okay, what I'm going to do here, I think, I think I'm going to end the recording for now. I think we did what I planned to do. This is exactly what I wanted to do. But I would love to hear what you guys think we should do with this series. Ah, looks like I'm going to go for the full moon. Oh. But yeah, you're awake. Apparently, I, I probably hurt some people, but yeah. So I think I'm going to end the recording here. I'd love to hear what you guys think. What do you guys want to see from this series? How do you want this to go? To be honest, um, I think we should probably just go for the Persia thing. But yeah, I'd love to hear what you guys think. Should we continue the series for a lot longer? Or would you rather it just be a short series so I can concentrate on other series? I'd love to see how you guys feel about that sort of thing. But yeah. I've been NG Paradox. This has been the Azure Horde. I'll see you guys next time. Good night.